Hey guys, it's FPS Mike here, and this is some gameplay that I have. I went 20 and 9, and this is on the map Grind. If you had, if you didn't know, um, the Revolution map pack just got released a few days ago for the PlayStation 3, and uh, I've been really excited because I got it, and um, the map is pretty cool. This one is called Grind. It's basically like a huge skate park. You're just running around killing people in a skate park. Um, and also, the new downloadable content gun, which is the Peacekeeper. That's a really cool feature. It's a submachine gun, but it has a lot of features and similarities to assault rifles like the damage. And I think the recoil, I don't know, to me the recoil on the Peacekeeper just feels like it's a little more than uh, normal. But also has the amazing iron sights. The iron sights on this gun are freaking amazing. I love the iron sights. It reminds me of the Scar H and I love the Scar H. And um, just if, I want to talk a little bit about the map, um, the gameplay on Grind. It seems like everyone who's playing the Revolution... Uh, content pack download pack map pack um they all basically use the peacekeeper and i'm just kind of wondering if that's ever going to change because i'm thinking maybe it will after people just get sick and tired of the peacekeeper but who knows but it is a freaking amazing gun and the map is really cool there are a lot of little spots you can hide behind of and um drop shotting on this map will get you very very far i've killed so many people where i just kind of ran into them and i just had to drop shot and kill them um it's really amazing also with the peacekeeper there's a there's a little bit of disadvantage shit like when you go and use a smg or like if you're playing a normal map and someone else is shooting at you, chances are they might not kill you because they're a little bit inaccurate or um, like, you know, all, not all the bullets hit you. But with the Peacekeeper, it's so powerful that like you get hit like just, I don't know, I think it was like three or four times and you just get killed. Um, I don't know. That's like a cool thing about it. I guess it's like you can't just openly run out in the open and... Uh, get shot at and not die but i don't know i like the gun i like the maps um my opinion on the revolution map pack is uh they did a very good job releasing it like i would have never really thought of releasing a gun to just um people who purchased the map pack i mean that's that's a pretty cool thing to do, and uh, I wonder if they're gonna have other guns in different map packs, uh, which I really hope they do. And also, it's really cool because they don't uh, allow people who have the Revolution game, the uh, Revolution map packs, to play with the Peacekeeper like on normal maps, uh, which really just helps everyone out because nobody wants to be playing against someone with a better gun or to have an unfair opportunity. So. Uh, I think that's cool that they actually thought about that because I know other games where they'll just be like, oh, you bought this? All right, you can use it against other people even though they can't afford it or they can't buy it or whatnot. Anyways, that pretty much sums up my uh, opinion on the Revolution map pack. I, I love the map pack. I play like two maps on it and it's just like unbelievable. I love the gun and I got this sick gameplay. So, um yeah i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video and i'll see you at the outro friendly escort drone inbound pushing your location time now. that's a kill friendly warthog inbound good hits room for immediate reattack. losing bravo good kill hey, move it I dropped it Nemesis 1 1 as your target at 100 meters bearing UAV inbound. Good hits. Good strike. 2 EKA. Weapons away. Securing Alpha. Time's almost up. Good effects. Target destroyed. On your feet! Good kill. Nemesis 1 1 as your target. Securing A. 170. Uh, 
Good hits. Proof for me. Securing A. Report negative. Losing Charlie. All flags secured. Maintain current posture. Chester. Good. Hey guys, thanks for watching as always, and if you would like, there is a subscribe button in the middle, you can click that and subscribe if you aren't already subscribed. There are two recent videos, there's the one on the left, there's the which is a sniping montage, and there's the one on the right, which is a how to use the KSG montage. Anyways, I appreciate you watching. Peace out.